Good evening, everybody. You're looking live with Bear River Live here on the Watcher Network and an Iowa Skyview for Bear River Basketball. Last time the Bears played Skyview, they lost 65-52. Um, now we got to check that. That's the wrong paper. Sorry about that, everybody. We got about 2:30 left to go before the national anthem starting lineups and tip off. Hope you like the highlights. So if the Bear River Bears get a win tonight, Green Canyon loses tonight. I believe they're playing Ridgeline. We'll have a three-way tie for second place in region. So, another big game for the Bears. All right, last time they ever played Skyview, we lost 55-48. Mason Falls Lake scored 18 points for Skyview. Our big scorer, Jay, Jay, Jake Daly, scored 23. Jacob Olsen was six, Mark Huber with eight. Fonsbeck had five, Wide Rolled had six. Kobe Wilson, another one from Skyview, he scored 10. Berber didn't really get to the foul line a lot in that game. Only six times, and we only missed one free throw.
ready to go here in Skyview. Should be a good game. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'd like to say thank you to all our sponsors for making this possible. Kip goes to Skyview. Down low. Is it up? Dally on the defense gets it to roll in. Skyview on the board first. Oh, with it. Kicks it over to Olsen. Huber down low. Fonds back. Three in the corner. This one's short. Rebound Olsen. Now back over to Fonds back. Now to Huber. Dally with it. Puts it up. This one rattles out. We kind of had an off night against Green Canyon. Skyview on the drive. Puts up a shot. This is no good. Rebound Fonds back. Huber with it. Now Fonds back. Back to Huber. Dally. Back with it. Now up to Huber. Roll. Back to Wren. Wren. Dribbles it around. Gets it back out. Huber. Into the corner. Olsen goes baseline. Going to put it up. And this one rolls off. Out of bounds. Skyview basketball. Kicks it over to his near side. And it steps back, puts up a three. This one rolls off. Rebound Olsen. Huber down to Dally. Dally thought about putting it up. Kicks it back out. Dally gets it again this time. Pops one from the elbow, short. Rebound Skyview. Coming down the court quick on the left hand side layup. Lee with a layup for Skyview. Bonds back. Back out to Huber. Huber for three. Still off. Rebound Olsen. Dally had a cutter. Ren was running free. Lost the ball. He's going to take it himself. Puts it up. This one's short. Another rebound for Skyview. Kick it out. Thought about a three. Skyview going down. Dally on the defense. Banks it in. Skyview again. Dean gets a shot to go in for Skyview. Coach Hunt wants a timeout. We'll take it with him. It's 6-0. Skyview. Be right back. The Pie Dump at Bar TL Catering is a proud sponsor of the Bear River Bears. Owners Mac and Cherie Munns have been in business for 35 years. They have a full breakfast menu, yummy options for lunch, as well as a student menu. Come taste deliciousness with the best donuts in town and their famous hot rolls and gravy. If you're new, they'll treat you to the rip and dip experience. Rent out the Pie Dump's back room for a work lunch or family dinner. They'll leave and cater. Call 435-257-3947 for more information today. All right, welcome back. Bears starting off not quite how they wanted. Still scoreless in the first quarter. There's 454 left to go.
Bolton gets a screen. Back to Huber. Bonsback gets it poked away, gets it back though. Dally gets it back. Bonsback for three, this one no good. Rebound by Skyview. Skyview gonna try a three, this one's short. Rebound Dally. Dally with it, kicks it over to Huber. Huber trying to get around to the edge, gets it back out top. Now into the corner to Fonsbeck, he'll go baseline, gonna put it up, banks it in, and he gets the players on the board. Down Olsen on the defense, puts it up and in. Wilson again for Skyview, hitting a fadeaway shot. Three minutes now left to go in the first quarter. Huber going to put up a three. This one in and out. Rebound, Skyview. Drive puts it up, draws a foul. He'll go to the line, shoot two shots. Wilson, the one going to the line for Skyview. Let's take a look at the replay. Puts it up, must have got him on the arm as he went up. Quick up the court, also with it. Inside, Bonds back, puts it in. Lost live, almost lost the dribble. They're going to call that double dribble. Kicks it out, roll back up top to Huber. Huber down to Daly, Daly pump fakes. Spins around, puts up a shot, this one in. Jake Daly gets on the board. Tries to split the defense, kicks it out. Now they're gonna go baseline, reverse layup goes in. Minute 30 left to go in the first quarter. Inside, Daly again. Another spin, puts it up. And he's going to draw the foul. I got to push. Number zero, Skyview. Take a look at the replay, see if you see what the ref saw. Right there, that bump. Dally's first three throw up and good. He gets him ball.
Skyview kicks it all the way. That opposite side puts up a three ball. This one off the rim, no good. Rebound, Skyview with a putback. That one doesn't go. Going for a rebound, and they're going to call a foul. Loose ball foul on the Bears. Yeah, and Skyview, a little bit taller players than us, getting the rebound. Step back, puts up a three, and this one's short, and they're going to let it bounce out of bounds. The River Basketball. Bonds back with it. Kicks it back up top to Huber. Olsen now back over to Huber. Rollholt in the corner. That's Bonds back for three. We got a tie ball game at 11. Skyview gets it down low, now kicks it back out. We got 14 seconds left to go here in the first quarter. We might be holding for the last shot. Here comes the three pointer on the way, and it's good. So at the end of the first quarter, Skyview leads by three. 14 to 11. We'll take a break and be right back. For a genuinely warm welcome with small town friendly service, stop by Grill. They have slowly smoked ribs, wings, and briskets, along with homemade appetizers, unique sandwiches, pizzas, and burgers. They also have tasty desserts. The Grill is the perfect location for family get togethers or business lunches. If you'd rather, they can cater an event for you. For some added fun, call the Bowling Center and reserve a lane. Mondays are family night or swing by on $2 Tuesdays. If you like cosmic bowling, stop by on Fridays and Saturdays. No matter what you like, the Grill has something for everyone. If you are in need of financial assistance, call Dusty Roach at Lincoln Financial. He and his friendly staff have the expertise you'll need. All right, welcome back. Beaver picks it up a little bit after that timeout by Coach Hunt. They get back in this ball game. It was tied, but that three-pointer right at the end of the first by Lee of Skyview gives them the three-point advantage. Bear River's going to start us off with the possession for the second quarter. Skyview has one team foul. Bear River has two. Pass almost tipped away. Bonds back, loses it. Here comes Skyview. This one's blocked by Olsen. Huber with it. On the move, kicks it out. Back inside. Huber, easy layup. Skyview looking to drive. Little hook shot, rolls in. That's Wilson for Skyview. Wilson with it, he kicks it across court. Bad decisions, pass stolen away. Over the easy layup, 18-13 now for Skyview. Daly kicks it out, Fonz back for three. This one's in. You see Caldwell Baker up there as our 
One of our sponsors. Too bad that's not at home. That would have been a money ball. That's got to be a travel. No, they're going to call it jump ball. Yeah, I don't. I don't get it. it. Depends on which game you're at. They'll call a jump ball in a split second, or they'll let them go all the way to the ground with it before they call anything. Skyview with it. Pass, puts up. This one's missed. Rebound Skyview, though. He banks it in. Rafford banks it in after the putback. Or after the rebound, excuse me. Huber with it, bringing it down for the Bears. So it fawns back, back to Huber. Going over to Roll Holt, he kicks it down low to Coons. Daly with it. Daly puts it up, and he's going to go to the line, shooting two shots. They'll get a replay on that one. And that is Skyview's second team foul. First one up, in and out. Kelly's second free throw is up, and this one's off. And rebound Skyview. Wide open three pointer. He's going to take it and he's going to make it. Foreman makes a three pointer for Skyview. Tucker Coombs with it. Kick over. Fonds back. Why not for three? This one's in. He's warming up. He could have a good game like he did against Ridgeline where he could just hit it from anywhere. This guy up top with it. Looks to drive. Gets it stolen away. Here comes Huber. Tries to split the defense. Puts it up. Draws the foul and one. Mark Huber going to the line. Shooting one shot. Here's your replay. He got stripped away. Huber right there to take it from him. Mark Huber kills the kills. Mark Huber can't complete the three point play. A screen, puts up a shot. This is short. A rebound, Skyview. An easy put back. Twenty-five, twenty-one, Skyview. Huber puts up a three. This is no good. A rebound, also. Foslov step back and shoots. Well, Chomp thought he pushed off. Here comes the Bears. Fonz back with it. Get down to Daly. Daly's going to drive. He's going to call a foul. It'll be on the ground. Huber with it. Kicks it over to Fonsbeck. Back over to Huber. Coombs with the pass. Going to drive instead. Puts it up and banks it in. Parker Coombs. Uh, 
Pass over to the far side now. Go back over to the near side. They're gonna call foul on Skyview. They call it on Furman, that's his first personal. Team foul, number five. Keeper with it with the Bears up top, kicks it over to Rohl, now over to Fonsbeck, way downtown. No good. He's down, kicks it back out and out of the corner, puts up a three, this one doesn't go. Tapped around. Skyview's going to keep it. Tries to go down low. Coons defending. Huber comes and helps. Shoots a fadeaway. Doesn't go. Rebound by River. Coons, Coons, he'll set up a three pointer. This one doesn't go. Another rebound for Skyview. And Skyview is going to take a timeout. We'll take one with them with 2.12 left to go before halftime, 27-23. Skyview will be right back. Caldwell Banker has a team of dedicated professionals who handle the complex process and make sure things run smoothly. As a proud sponsor, Caldwell Banker donates to Bear River Athletics through the Moneyball. For every three-pointer at home, the boys' basketball team earns $20. Save time and money with Caldwell Banker. If you are selling, give Gary Madsen a call for a free market analysis at 435-257-5089. Twelve left to go. Still a close game. 27-23 for Skyview. They got the lead and the ball. On the far side, tries to get it in. Stolen away. Roll hold, here he comes, puts up a shot and a foul. He's going to be on the shot. He'll go, he'll go to the line shooting two. Good still. Good job to draw the foul. That was kind of, <laughs> looked like it was a little difficult to do. Roll hold, first free throw good. Puts up a second, and it's good as well. You watch Rohol on defense. Everywhere Falsliff goes, Rohol's right there. He's glued to his hip. Kick out up top. And I don't know why they stopped it. Oh, the clock wasn't running. All right, here we go, Skyview with it. Near side, back up top. Dribbles it around to this near side. Ball slip with it. And he says, roll holds right there. Kick out, up top. Trying to work it inside, Dally's there. Trying to size him up, and Dally's gonna get called for a foul. Dean will go to the line for Skyview, shooting two shots with 104 left to go before halftime.
First free throw up and good for Dean. Skyview has six team fouls, Bever has three. Four point ball game. Bombs back, kicks it over to Olsen, Olsen over to Coons. Now Dally with it, looking for a cutter, kicks it back out to Olsen. Parker, Olsen, three, got it! One point ball game, under a minute left to go. Right before halftime. <laughs> Off the screen, kick it out. Three pointer on the way. This one's no good. Rebound Olsen, and that is gonna be the end of the first half. We have a one point ball game, 29-28 for Skyview. Looks like this is gonna be another good one, all the way to the end. We'll thank our sponsors, and we'll be right back. Time to load up. At Taco Time. Introducing the new fully loaded burrito, just $1.99. Original, green, or blazing five alarm. Fill up with the fully loaded burrito for just $1.99 only at Taco Time, where real ingredients make better food. Tanglewood Studios begins its 10th year offering recreational and competitive classes for all ages. The vocal music classes feature a live accompanist, instruments, music therapy, and performances. Mom and Me classes are offered as well as preschool, karate, parkour, and adult fitness classes. Tanglewood is a USAG licensed gym offering bars, beam, vault, and floor. There's a great cheer and color guard program and dance classes from point to co-ed hip-hop. They really do have something for everyone. Be sure to check out their website, tanglewood-studio.com, and come join the fun. Family rates are available. Specialty Bismarck's and Red Velvet Cookies might just be the deliciousness your Valentine desires. The Pie Dump will have some of these treats on hand, but make sure you get what you want by pre-ordering today. Celebrate Valentine's Day with your sweetheart at the grill from February 10th through the 17th. Get a free dessert to share when you buy one appetizer and two dinner entrees. They will also be serving prime rib on their regular Friday and Saturday nights, along with on Valentine's Day, Wednesday the 14th, after 5 p.m. Andy Marchant Photography specializes in portraits, family pictures, bridals, and engagements. But Marchant is now gearing up for another great season of Bear River Sports. Check out his website, andymarchant.com, and let him help you preserve your memories. The Pie Dump at Bartiel Catering is a proud sponsor of the Bear River Bears. Owners Mac and Cherie Munns have been in business for 35 years. They have a full breakfast menu, yummy options for lunch, as well as a student menu. Come taste deliciousness with the best donuts in town and their famous hot rolls and gravy. If you're new, they'll treat you to the rip and dip experience. Run out the Pie Dump's back room for a work lunch or family dinner. They'll leave and cater. Call 435-257-3947 for more information today. For a genuinely warm welcome with small town friendly service, stop by The Grill. They have slowly smoked ribs, wings, and briskets, along with homemade appetizers, unique sandwiches, pizzas, and burgers. They also have tasty desserts. The Grill is the perfect location for family get-togethers or business lunches. If you'd rather, they can cater an event for you. For some added fun, call the Bowling Center and reserve a lane. Mondays are family night or swing by on $2 Tuesdays. If you like cosmic bowling, stop by on Fridays and Saturdays. No matter what you like, the Grill has something for everyone.
Global Banker has a team of dedicated professionals who handle the complex process and make sure things run smoothly. As a proud sponsor, Caldwell Banker donates to Bear River Athletics through the Moneyball. For every three-pointer at home, the boys' basketball team earns $20. Save time and money with Caldwell Banker. If you are selling, give Gary Madsen a call for a free market analysis at 435-257-5089. If you are in need of financial assistance, call Dusty Roach at Lincoln Financial. He and his friendly staff have the expertise you'll need.
welcome back. Hope you enjoyed your first half highlights. We got a tie one, 29-28. Like to wish the Barber Wrestling Team good luck. They're about wrapping up the first night of the state tournament. We have been giving uh, updates on our Facebook page, but obviously had to stop so we could come do this. Barely to find a way to get some spacing in between us and Skyview on the scoreboard. Barber's going to have the possession. So this third quarter. It's an end to Huber. The second half is underway. They're going to say off Fonsbeck and turnover by Bear River right in front of the coach. He did not look happy. Not a way you want to start off coming right out of halftime as a turnover. Skyvy has it on that far side. Get the screen, falls with. Kicks it down. Turn around. Hook shot doesn't go. Rebound Skyview. Puts up a three. This one no good. Rebound. Bear River. Olsen with it. Steps back, puts it up. This one's no good. And rebounds the guy to you. Roll, it almost pokes it away. Boss lift, kicks it inside, puts it up. And this puts his in. down Huber. Huber going to drive. Nice move inside and it goes in. Kick down. Dally and Olsen on the defense. He got it, a hit off a of dally. It'll stay here. Skyview basketball. And now Coach Hunt wants to talk about it. After he gets done giving it to the ref. And we will take a break and be right back. Specialty Bismarck's and Red Velvet Cookies might just be the deliciousness your Valentine desires. The Pie Dump will have some of these treats on hand, but make sure you get what you want by pre-ordering today. If you are in need of financial assistance, call Dusty Roach at Lincoln Financial. He and his friendly staff have the expertise you'll need. Celebrate Valentine's Day with your sweetheart at the grill from February 10th through the 17th. Get a free dessert to share when you buy one appetizer and two dinner entrees. They will also be serving prime rib on their regular Friday and Saturday nights, along with on Valentine's Day, Wednesday the 14th, after 5 p.m. All right, welcome back. Still a one-point ball game. Scotty has it under the basket. Puts it up, no good. Ball is loose. going to call a loose ball foul. And they're going to call it on Bear River. They're going to call it on Roholt, see what you can see. Oh, he's... I don't think so. He's back and he's boxing him out. It's not his fault the guy jumps over him. Yeah, I think that one goes the wrong way. He 
Inside, went for the dunk, and they're going to call a foul. Let's see what we can see on this one. They call it on Valley. I don't, I don't get it. Put two team fouls for the Bears. First free throw up and good. good as well. Huber now, Fonsbeck. Fonsbeck kicks it back out, Olson. Huber up top with it. Daly looks to drive, stops, kicks it out. Roll hold for three, this one's off the rim, no good. Rebound Olson. Kick back out to Huber. Huber looks to drive, stops at the free throw line, puts up a shot and in. Skyview quickly down the court. False lift puts up a three. This one's no good, a rebound. Jacob Olson. This one's stolen away by Falsaliv. And Olsen is going to get a foul. Falsaliv wants a person or wants a flagrant. I don't think he's going to get it. He just tried to get it. He just jumped. He jumped. Falsaliv didn't. Anyways, Greg Olsen, that's a second personal. So I hate Jacob Olsen. Well, football's been over for a while. I don't know why I do that still. First free throw good for Falsalip. And he gets them both. Almost throw him away. Comes roll hole. He puts up a layup. This one doesn't go. But he's going to get a steal. Olsen with it. Fonsbeck. Over to Fonsbeck. Fonsbeck. Olsen puts up a three. Off the back of the iron. No good. They're going to call a foul on Skyview. And that's going to be on false with Skype your crowd don't like it. Olsen with it, kicks it over to Huber. Daly with it on the drive, going to go up hard. And it's going to be blocked back to his face. And here comes Skyview up the court quick, and now Daly. Goes up, it looked bad from this angle. Take a look at the replay. I don't think they like how they wrapped his arms around him and they are gonna give him a, they are gonna give him a flagrant foul on that one. Coach Hunt's going to call a timeout, calm everybody down. 4.23 left to go in the third. 35-32 ball game. We'll be right back. Andy Merchant Photography specializes in portraits, family pictures, bridals, and engagements. But Marchant is now gearing up for another great season of Bear River Sports. Check out his website, andymarchant.com, and let him help you preserve your memories. 
Soup's on at the grill Monday through Saturday. With a new tasty soup every day, you can pick up lunch or dinner all week long. Find out which flavor is your favorite by picking up a small bowl for $3.99 or make it a large for $5.99. Alright, welcome back. Oh, it's still talking to the refs about Rohold not getting the foul call on the other end. Also, they're going to shoot the foul shot for Skyview. We throw up and in and out. Still a three point ball game. Second one up, and he gets this one. In the corner. Dribbles back out. Now from the corner, they put up a three, and they hit it. Call a foul on number zero of Skyview. Not sure what happened. It was, a, it was away from the play, away from the ball. Here comes Huber with it. Skyview has two team fouls. Berber has four. Olsen with it. Daly pulls up, puts a three off the front of the iron, rebound. Skyview. Over to this corner, they put up a three there. This one's not even close. Gets his own rebound, tries to go down inside to Dean. Dean's going to have to fight for it, and they're going to call a jump ball, but Dean pushes, falls back away, and there's nothing. Take a look at the replay. You know, we just can't get a get a handle on it. And then right there's a shove. Skyview with it under the hoop. False lift. Quick up and in. Huber with it. Gets it down. Dally can't hold it, but they're going to call a foul on Skyview. Dally to inbound. Now back to him. A kick out. Olsen with it. Looks to drive. Stops at the free throw line. Puts up a sweet shot. Also live on the drive. Going to put it up. And it's go and it goes in, sorry. Just under three minutes now. 43-34 for Skyview. Ren puts up a three. This one doesn't go. And they're gonna call a foul on number three of Skyview. Take a look at it. I don't know. To me it kinda looked like it was on Huber. He didn't have the position on him. Maybe that arm swinging back at him. So we're tied with four team fouls. Parker Coombs comes in for the Bears. He's got the ball right now. Looks the drive, he does. This one. Off the rim, here comes Skyview. Ball lift, drives in, and they call it Charge on false lift. Take a look at the replay. Oh yeah, he's there.
Huber with it. So over to Parker. Parker. Dally. Backs him up. Kicks it out. Olsen for three. This one's in. So now when Rojo goes out, it's Parker's job to stick with false live. Bank shot goes in for Skyview. On the drive, Huber puts it up, too hard, doesn't go. And rebound, Skyview. Kicked out, three pointer on the way, in and out, rebound, Fonz back. Fonz back for three. This is no good. We're going to sit on this one. We got just about a minute left to go in the third quarter. 45 37 for Skyview. comes out to guard him. Off the screen. Back up too hard. And the putback doesn't go. Gets his own rebound. Puts it back again. Dean still can't get it in. Rebound Olsen. Bears got time. Hold it for the final shot. Huber with it. Instead, he puts up a quick three-pointer. This one doesn't go. And a rebound. Kicked out for three. And it's no good. The end of the third. 45-37 for Skyview. We'll be back with the fourth quarter. The Pie Dump at Bar TL Catering is a proud sponsor of the Bear River Bears. Owners Mac and Cherie Munns have been in business for 35 years. They have a full breakfast menu, yummy options for lunch, as well as a student menu. Come taste deliciousness with the best donuts in town and their famous hot rolls and gravy. If you're new, they'll treat you to the rip and dip experience. Rent out the Pie Dumps back room for a work lunch or family dinner. They'll leave and cater. Call 435-257-3947 for more information today. For a genuinely warm welcome with small town friendly service, stop by The Grill. They have slowly smoked ribs, wings, and briskets, along with homemade appetizers, unique sandwiches, pizzas, and burgers. They also have tasty desserts. The Grill is the perfect location for family get-togethers or business lunches. If you'd rather, they can cater an event for you. For some added fun, call the Bowling Center and reserve a lane. Mondays are family night or swing by on $2 Tuesdays. If you like cosmic bowling, stop by on Fridays and Saturdays. No matter what you like, the grill has something for everyone. All right, welcome back. Thanks for joining us tonight. We're about ready to get this fourth quarter underway. Skyview still leads Kim's going to inbound for the Bears. Gets it into Huber. Bounds back with it. Kicks it out. Olsen going to drive. And it's blocked. And they're going to say a foul. Nope, timeout, Bear River. All right, it's going to be a quick one. We'll be right back. 
Specialty Bismarck's and Red Velvet Cookies might just be the deliciousness your Valentine desires. The Pie Dump will have some of these treats on hand, but make sure you get what you want by pre-ordering today. Celebrate Valentine's Day with your sweetheart at the grill from February 10th through the 17th. Get a free dessert to share when you buy one appetizer and two dinner entrees. They will also be serving prime rib on their regular Friday and Saturday nights, along with on Valentine's Day, Wednesday the 14th, after 5 p.m. Alright, welcome back. is going to press. Take it across half court. They kick it back up. Kick it back out top. Now over to that far side. Now to this near side. Tries to go inside. Pass deflected. Now back by Skyview. Down inside, nobody's there. Wilson gets it in for Skyview. Huber off the screen, kicks it down to Dally. Dally puts it up. And they're gonna call a block on number four, Skyview. Wilson gets called for the foul. Tried to sell a charge. Jesse Roach, who is best known, known for his hootie, is a great financial advisor. He has got big city services, but provides small town care. If you have financial needs, they've got you covered. Valley puts up a second free throw. It's good. Quickly down the court. Easy two points for Skyview. Dally, Huber for three. This one's in. Probably going to need a little bit more of those before this one's over. Goes inside. Shut up, no good. Rebound, Olsen. Olsen going to try to drive, and they're going to call a foul on Skyview. No, they're going to come back and call a charge. Let's take a look and see what you think. Yeah, he's still moving. There's no way. There is no way. That's a charge. Six team fouls for Bear River, five. Excuse me, five for Bear River, six for Skyview. Down inside the kick it back out. Ball still with it. Pass inside. Olsen gonna get called for a foul. Former gonna go shoot two for Skyview. I'd like to thank Tanglewood Studios for being a halftime sponsor for us this year, basketball and for football. You're never too too young to start your kids in gymnastics, dancing. You know, they've got a lot going on over there. Go check them out. Tanglewood-studios.com. Free throw no good. Here comes the Bears. Quick shot goes up and in. And that was Huber. Let's 
seven point ball game. Skyview puts up a three, this one no good, rebound Dally. Bonds back on the drive, puts up a shot, gonna be short. Rebound Skyview. It was free sample Friday, the pie of today. They had their Valentine's cookies out. I wasn't able to go in there and get one. I was kind of bummed out about it, but we'll get one before Valentine's Day. Skyview with it. Gonna drive. They let him go. Floater goes in for Skyview. Kick out, Olsen for three, and we need it. This one doesn't go. Rebound Skyview. Down inside. Layup doesn't go, rebound Fonsbeck. Parker to Huber, Huber gonna drive baseline, they're gonna call foul, Skyview. We're gonna be in the one on one situation. Remember the 10th through the 17th. Take your Valentine to the grill and get a free dessert when you buy an appetizer and two dinner entrees. First free throw up and in for Huber. And he's gonna get a second. Coach Hunt wants to take a timeout. Four minutes left to go, 52-45. Skyview leads, we'll be right back. Caldwell Banker has a team of dedicated professionals who handle the complex process and make sure things run smoothly. As a proud sponsor, Caldwell Banker donates to Bear River Athletics through the Moneyball. For every three-pointer at home, the boys' basketball team earns $20. Save time and money with Caldwell Banker. If you are selling, give Gary Madsen a call for a free market analysis at 435-257-5089. On at the grill Monday through Saturday. With the new tasty soup every day, you can pick up lunch or dinner all week long. Find out which flavor is your favorite by picking up a small bowl for $3.99 or make it a large for $5.99. Alright, welcome back. Still a close one. And still a lot of time to go here in the fourth quarter. I could thank Eddie Margin, who's been a good sponsor for us from the beginning. Go check his stuff out at AddieMarchant.com. I've seen a lot of things on Facebook and Twitter from him also. He's here tonight taking pictures. There he is right there. Skyview with it on this near side. They're going to call a block. That's going to be on Rojo. And now we are in the one on one situation on this side. Ball slid to the line for Skyview. This one in and out. Fonsbeck with it up top, kicks it over to Huber. 
Moving down low to Daly. Daly's going to go for it. Puts it up, makes it off the glass, rolls around and in. Balls live with it. Hand it off. Gets a screen from Dean. Back out, wide open lane. He's going to take it. Is it an easy, lazy, easy layup for Coleman? Pass almost taken away. Fonz back with it. Stops, pops. Shot doesn't go. Rebound, Skyview. False live is down, and Skyview is going to call a timeout. He's a little slow to get up. So this will be a quick timeout. We'll be right back. The Pie Dump of RTL Catering is a proud sponsor of the Bear River Bears. Owners Mac and Cherie Munns have been in business for 35 years. They have a full breakfast menu, yummy options for lunch, as well as a student menu. Come taste deliciousness with the best donuts in town and their famous hot rolls and gravy. If you're new, they'll treat you to the rip and dip experience. Run out the Pie Dump's back room for a work lunch or family dinner. They'll leave and cater. Call 435-257-3947 for more information today. All right, welcome back. Skyview takes it over here on this near side. Picked it up top to Dean. Dean kicks it over. Now down low. To the shot, banks it in. Wilson, Skyview. Daly gonna go. Nice shot, banging off the glass. Jake Daly. We need quick points like that, but we need turnovers. From Skyview, obviously. Up top on the drive, they kick it back out. Dribble backs out. 137 left to go in the ball game. And they're going to call a foul on number 34, the Skyview. Take a look at it. It looked pretty hard to me. Skyview fans don't like it. Oh, yeah, he slid into him. Cooper with it. Got to take advantage of this. Huber puts up a floater, banks it in. Now quick to go, Dean puts it up and in. Fifty-eight, fifty-one. About about a minute left to go. Bonds back with it. Gives it back to Rollholt. Rollholt kicks it out. Huber for three. Doesn't go. Rebound. Daly goes for the putback and it's going to go to the line. Shoot two shots. Yeah, it would have been nice if that three-pointer would have fell. 
But Dally, way to be there. Out rebound to two defenders. First free throw up and good. Skyview is up to 19 fouls. Forever has seven. Dally's second free throw up, and this one's no good. Rebound Skyview. Poked away by Olsen. Olsen's going to dive for it. And they're going to say out of bounds. Skyview ball. They get the inbounds pass quickly down the court. Kick out, you gotta do something, you gotta foul, and there's the foul. 34 seconds left to go. Also live gonna go to the line. Smith to the line for Skyview. First one's up and in. You're gonna do a little substitution. Huber quick down the court, puts it up. This is no good. Rebound Huber. They kick it back out. Olsen for three. We need it. And he got it. And a quick timeout by Bear River. 60 55, five point ball game with 32 seconds. We'll have to go. We'll be right back. Celebrate Valentine's Day with your sweetheart at the grill from February 10th through the 17th. Get a free dessert to share when you buy one appetizer and two dinner entrees. They will also be serving prime rib on their regular Friday and Saturday nights, along with on Valentine's Day, Wednesday the 14th, after 5 p.m. Specialty Bismarck's and Red Velvet Cookies might just be the deliciousness your Valentine desires. The Pie Dump will have some of these treats on hand, but make sure you get what you want by pre-ordering today. If you are in need of financial assistance, call Dusty Roach at Lincoln Financial. He and his friendly staff have the expertise you'll need. All right, well, welcome back. We got 23.2 seconds on the clock in a five-point ball game. Again, you're to the position where you don't want them to get it in. If they do, you got to foul. I'd like to thank the Python for being a main basketball sponsor for us. They've been with us through football, and not a basketball. And there's the quick foul by Huber. Lee will go to the line for Skyview. Still in the one and one and one. Now Skyview is going to sub. First one's up, but no good. Olsen with the rebound. Got to go down quick, got to score. It's going to be a kick ball Skyview, by Skyview. Berber keeps it. 17 seconds. Roll to inbound, gets it in. 
Dally, the spin. Back out Huber, Huber gets the screen. Now he's gonna go on the drive, but he's gonna be fouled by number four. Now we're in the double bonus. Reds will be available at the grill on Valentine's Day, plus on every Friday and Saturday night. First one doesn't go. 11 seconds left in the ball game. Smith comes back in for Skyview. Cooper second one drops. Coombs comes in, Olsen comes out for Bay River. Long pass, Foswell has it. And the layup doesn't go, but he was fouled, so we'll go to the line shooting two shots. Nine seconds. Four point ball game. Now a five. Bears just wasn't able to pull ahead tonight. I don't think they had the lead at all during the game. They got it tied, but Skyview just keeps pulling away. Rojo kicks it over. Huber sets up a three pointer. This one's in. And that's going to be the end of the ball game. So your final on this one, Bear River. Balls to Skyview again, 62-59. You know, it's a break. Bears, I believe, still stay in fourth. I don't think anything changes there. But... Uh, Yeah, next week uh, they'll have Mountain Crest and then wrapping it up with Logan, which is going to be a good game to watch, too. We'd like to thank our sponsors. You see them all right there. The Grill, the Pida, main sponsors for us. Tanglewood Studios and Taco Time for halftime sponsors. Caldwell Banker does the money ball when we're at home. Andy Marshall Photography, he was here tonight, like I said, and the League of Financial. You know, if you like this and want more of this, you know, go to those sponsors and tell them thank you for letting this be a possibility. We wouldn't be able to do it without them. So we have wrestling going on, state wrestling going on this weekend. We can't, we can't stream it because of uh, broadcasting rights, but we can give you some highlights and we will have that for you tomorrow. So be watching for them. We'll post them on Facebook, maybe get them on our website, brlivestream.com. And then we start it off next week, Tuesday, Lady Bears basketball. We'll be at home against Mountain Crest. The boys will face Mountain Crest over here in Hiram on Wednesday. Then the Lady Bears will travel to Logan on Thursday, wrap up their region play, and then we will have Logan home wrapping up the boys region play. Well, that's going to be it for that's going to be it for us tonight. Thank you for watching. Thanks to our sponsors again. You've been watching Forever Live on the Watching Network.